The Light of Love is a uh, story um, that is told in a commedia style uh, with the classic commedia characters, therefore it is a commedia show. Um, it is taking these stock characters and putting them in a situation where they are in search of and fulfilling the needs of one another in uh, whether that be in adventure, in um, romance, in hijinks, um, in skullduggery. Uh, that's skullduggery. skullduggery. <laughs> yeah, we're not skullduggery in this. I think if there is, we should add it back in. I hope it comes up in improv. It better. All right. All right. So um, these are the things that you'll find in the light of love. Um, basically. We have uh, two sets of lovers, um, the servant set and then the, the enamorati, the young lovers. Um, and uh, both are finding ways in which they can, uh, in which they can get together. Um, and it's about the triumph of, of that love and, and the links that you'll go to for it. Um, and, and what, you know, the illumination that comes from the pursuit of that goal. It's right. knowledge in a sense. I mean, it's the kind of gaining life experience, wisdom, how it doesn't just come through a book, it comes through experience, it comes through your adventures, your trials, your tribulations, your skullduggery. Yeah, and knowing each other. I think it's a big, a big process, not just of self-discovery, but of discovery of those who are in your world, your day-to-day -day companions, mm -hmm. your peers, and, uh, and taking the time and investing with them and um, listening to each other tell each other's stories. But I mean, to go cyclical on that, in the end, it's a story. It's meant to entertain an audience for an hour and a half and just be a pleasant experience. You can walk away from not going, oh, the world is, is dark and deep and I need to go explore everything. It's, it's about coming out going, that was great. That was, mm -hmm. I enjoyed that time that was worth every penny I paid for it, I want to come back. And that's really, really what it's about. Mm -hmm. it's, um, it's, it's very much a, a collaboration of a bunch of artists that we brought together, um, some that we know, some that we're eager to get to mm -hmm. know, and, um, and we all are going to put our stamp on this story that is essentially about the triumph of love, um, the little things that get in the way. Every comedian story is essentially about mm -hmm. love um, and how to get it and how, um, how to keep it uh, and, uh, and all the other fun stuff that comes along with it. So, so we've definitely got that. Plus we threw in a very self-referential bit using mythology of the Greeks and the Promethean myth yes, the because that's the name of the theater company that happens to be producing this show. So we're very thoughtful in that regard. We are, I think we are. it was really nice of us. I think that's what helped us to the make, show. Uh, well, it to have Stephen Bryan <laughs> to give us some money to do it. Um, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was good. It's all about pandering. My ego feels actually inflated because <laughs> there was a time where I was like, I'm not sure, this story might be too good for you. And then I think he, I don't know, he gave me a back rub. It was nice, Stephen. Not Brian. Right. No, Brian's back rubs are awful. Yeah. <coughs> Stephen was good though. Yeah. He was gentle. <laughs> Soft like a kid. Mm -hmm. So anyway, so here we are. You know that it would be untrue. You know that I would be a liar If I was to say to you Girl, we couldn't get much higher Come on, baby, let